In this video, I used over 80 fragile resin to fix my viewer's cursed account. Will I be able to take it from zero to hero? Well, let's find out. So, okay, yeah, uh, just by looking at this roster, you guys could get a good grasp of what level my characters are. A lot of her characters are very underleveled, and she does not have many characters on her party on her account. So yeah, this is going to be a very big challenge of mine because not only do I have to level up their characters, I have to farm a lot of things for the characters to actually be maximized, and the biggest reason reason why I wanted to save her account was because she actually has 80 fragile resin saved up since when she first started playing the game and you guys can kind of do the math on this one she basically has around 5,000 resin in total which I'm going to be using all today and making the best roster possible so she can actually play this game and defeat enemies very quick and have a fun time so I actually asked them what character they wanted a team around and they told me it was Lenny so I decided to make the best free to play Lenny roster I can make which is Shangling Lenny uh, uh yeah dead i i would showcase her right now but uh, unfortunately i can't <laughs> okay there we go now linda is actually healed and then finally bennett so first of all i think our first objective is going to be building linny which i'm probably going to make them level 80 i want to make them the best character on their team because this is going to be the main person to actually deal the most damage i'd say especially how they just got the five star bow one of the best bows in my opinion in the game these are the stats that we have currently so i'm going to keep note of this and then once we actually finish up everything we will see the difference of all these characters and the amount of damage they do okay so since we can uh see what materials we actually need to get to level 80 we're gonna need nine more of these emperor resolution materials which i actually haven't even farmed on my account because i don't even have Linny. so let's get nine more of these real quick okay so since this character i'm pretty sure has a pyro type shield this is gonna be a very hard challenge just killing this enemy it's gonna be level 83 our characters are already under leveled to even defeat this enemy so i mean just by the damage you guys can tell that yeah we do not do a lot of damage at all and i'm pretty sure they don't even have their talents leveled up yep talents are level one <laughs> you know what can we level up any talents right now no we can't okay so today's a sunday and i'm actually going to be able to farm every single thing for every single character so i think that's a big plus i just noticed shangli doesn't even artifacts so let's just put some random artifacts for her and i can't even equip them okay great okay uh this is gonna take a very long time so i did have a little plan uh, and that plan was to see if we can first of all stay alive which uh seems like a very hard task at the moment <laughs> i'm actually uh, there goes Shangling. Okay. But do not worry. I do have a plan after this. After hopefully our characters do not all die. And I just realized we don't have our... Yeah. So my idea was pretty simple. I have someone that actually wants to help out and they did not add me yet okay uh okay stella has added me and now she will be appearing in three two one voila okay that was kind of lenny's magic right there by the way that was real that was not fake at all but uh stella's here stella's gonna be my savior she is actually level 58 a uh, higher level than me and with characters that could probably deal a lot of damage against enemies so oh my god i just realized that they have Fremenant, the new character that actually just came out recently oh my god the idol animation of Fremenant is so cute what the wait they're actually gonna make me want to roll for Fremenant on my account of course love y'all okay i told them if they want to say anything to you guys and she said love you guys oh that's really sweet okay so since we have Stella on our team now. I actually wonder how much damage Stella is going to do against this enemy. They have a Hydro character, which is Kokomi, and then they have Permanent, who is a... Oh, God, I, I'm actually dead. Uh, you know what? Let me stay near Stella because Stella might heal me. Uh, wait, uh, uh, Stella, uh, uh, I, I do need some healing with Lenny. <laughs> Lenny just died. Oh, God. Okay, so this is where we do a lot of damage, and thankfully, their Kokomi is actually pretty good i'm not gonna lie 6k damage is actually pretty insane and there we go that took a little bit of time but i mean we did defeat it so i think that's all that really matters thank you still once again and uh yeah uh we got two of these two to three i'm pretty sure so we will be farming this like i said a couple of times guys i kind of just went through their characters for a second and i just realized most of their characters don't even have their talents leveled up that's actually something that's kind of confusing for new players and this is actually really surprising i mean some of the characters are level one i'm actually glad i'm gonna be able to save autumn's account a little bit because you know just by looking at these characters i know i can just do a decent job at building a good roster and making their account at least viable you know so after stell carried me two more times throughout this adventure of trying to kill this boss that's higher level than me but we're not going to talk about that it was time to actually level up my Linny after having all the materials let's level up Linny to level 70 at least because i think we can level up him a little bit more to level 80 which is going to be my goal level 69 the magical number 
number and level 70. Okay, that actually looks really satisfying. I don't know why. So they don't have enough of these rainbow roses. So I am actually going to collect some of these. And I think we're just going to farm those really quickly. Okay, now we have enough flowers. Thank you, this person named Lumine that I just joined randomly. Okay, I need to craft 10 of these. That did take a little bit, but it was all worth it because now Liddy is level 80, which was our objective. And we do have a free Equine Fate that, of course, I'm going to use because I use every single free Equine Fate that we get. Wait, I just realized they still have the Noel banner. Oh my god, they have the Noel banner still. This is actually really rare because most people, most people would uh, decide to roll in this banner just so they can get Noel or another five-star character that match appears but so my next thing that i'm going to be leveling up is their bow because their bow is very important because of the crit damage that lenny does i'm so glad that they have condensed resin because they do not have the mre gadget so let's go level up Liddy's weapon and of course by leveling up their weapon we have to farm this domain <laughs> Okay, after farming the domain five times and dying numerous of times with my Lumine, I am now able to level up Lenny's weapon as much as I can. I didn't do the map on how much I can actually level up his weapon, so we're going to kind of find out ourselves and also craft the materials needed. Okay, that was level 40, and now we need these drop of tainted waters, and we only have 16. Okay, uh, maybe Stardust, and it's sold out. That's even worse, so I guess we have to farm some of these. Yeah, <laughs> we're going to have to farm a lot of things for just leveling up Lenny, which is crazy but we can do it we can do it i thought i was the one doing like 6k damage but i just realized it was the loot that was carrying me right there <laughs> Oh god, the Luke is actually really overpowered. Oh, you even got this chest with that. I didn't know this chest was gonna unlock too. <laughs> okay, so now I think I farmed some of these slimes, enough of these slimes, and I think we can level up the weapon to at least level 70, which I kind of was aiming for. Wait, where's the crafting table? Am I- Wait, I could have sworn the crafting table was around here. Crafting table is right here. Oh my god, I am so clueless. Alright, let's level up the weapon even more. This weapon is gonna be a big help once again. Level 50, level 60, level 70. It is time level 80 weapon oh wow i just realized we can't even go past level 80 because we're not even rank ar50 so yeah this is basically the max for our ar that we're currently at right now so just to keep this in mind that i'll be farming these artifacts lastly for all these characters and we will instead go to the talents because the talents are the next important thing for Linny. so after leveling up Linny's weapon i actually am doing up to 2k damage now just with normal attacks which is huge and we don't even have our talents leveled up which is actually amazing it just shows the power of this five star weapon which i say is one of the best weapons in genshin impact as of now, right now so i cannot wait to level up Linny even more i really can't but that is our first run and once again we are just gonna speed run this domain because obviously i don't want you guys to just watch me farm this domain for uh, a couple of hours <laughs> Okay, so now that we farmed this domain a good amount of times, once again, I think we have enough talent level up materials to level up Linny's talents to a decent amount. Once again, always be near the crafting table whenever you have to level up things because you never know if you have to craft them later on. So let's focus on our normal and our skill for now. And oh no, don't tell me we need more of these insignias. Maybe we have a good... Huh? Yeah, we have to farm those uh, insignias. I did not think about that at all. I don't know why, but yeah, we're definitely going to reach a three hour mark of just building Linny, which is absolutely insane. But, you know, anything for Linny for now, right? <laughs> oh God, I am just drowning in pain right now. All right, I'm done with those insignias. I think I farmed, I don't know how many times I killed these guys, but level three, level four, level four, both of them. And we have five, five, three. Five, five, three is actually not bad. I don't want to waste a lot of their fragile resin more on their talents because they can, of course, farm this another day. Yeah, it's time for the artifact domain and we're going to need one of the newer artifacts for Linny. I am now probably going to use these six fragile resin and I'm surprised we still have a good amount. I thought I used more, but we're going to use that and then we're going to make our condenser resin i don't know why i just teleported <laughs> to the artifact domain when i should have just stayed where i was but yeah it's time to make our condensed resin and go to the artifact domain my goal is to first get a four piece set of yeah whatever the new set is called but at least a four piece set and then we can level up their artifacts right after why do i sound so excited i shouldn't sound excited at all i should sound worried i should sound very depressed thankfully we have dane for the rescue to carry me to victory and wow lenny's damage is actually really good i've been just seeing the damage difference compared to when we first started using 
Jason Linney, and I think we're doing up to like 5k just with our skills now because our skills are probably the most important part of Linney aside from the normal attack. I'm impressed with the damage we're seeing with Linney. Linney is actually a viable character now. I really cannot wait to build up the whole party because once we have the whole roster going, I know Linney's going to be even better. Okay, so this is the artifacts that I need for Linney. This right away, this feather could have crit damage and that would be insane, but just a four piece set, a good four piece set for Linney, and that's all I really need. How hard can it be to get a good four piece set for Linney? Well, um, honestly, I hope it's not going to be that hard. Wow, I did up to 15k with Linney. I just realized that. Holy, wait, our Linney's actually really good. Now I see why so many people roll for Linney. Wait, is Linney still on the banner? Oh, it's Zhongli. I don't know where I've been in the past two years. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh my god, we're just getting blessed with this set. I would love to have crit rank crit damage because that's what Lenny wants for a DPS. Now we have a sand, we have a feather, we have a flower, and now we are looking for a goblet or a circlet. Goblet, circlet, goblet, circlet. Oh my god, a feather. Oh my god, this is the other set. I was about to be like, holy crap. Crit rate, attack, energy, recharge. Amazing flower right there. Just give me one goblet, one circlet. One goblet, one circlet. Okay, our last condensed resin out of, I don't know how much resin I used. I'm pretty sure I used the normal amount, but yeah, this is unfortunate really good feather though we got some pretty good artifacts just from that domain i actually really do hate this domain though this domain is very very torturous but now that we have a three piece set for Linny, i think it's time to level up our artifacts i really want to see what force that we get with this one the moment of truth elemental mastery dude this is actually so good like it doesn't give us crit damage and crit rate but for just farming the domain for a little amount of time that is a really good feather i'm actually gonna level this one up because that's all good subsets first subset attack we just got attacked three times that's actually super unfortunate because we have super good subsets aside from attack oh my god i hit attack four times just when i said this feather is so good or this flower sorry i do need some crit rate autumn literally had this flower <laughs> on Linny, which is actually amazing but just give us crit rate okay crit rate elemental mastery Okay, I might level this one up instead because the last subset's gonna be crit rate and it hit HP. Fourth subset of our feather. We have two feathers that I think is pretty decent, and this fourth subset is gonna be defense. Wow, wow, wow. Every time I just get like a little bit excited, I feel like we get the wrong subset that we need, but amazing. Okay, we're gonna just level this one up instead, and yeah, crit rate one time, elemental mastery one time. That's how it started for the other one, and then it hit defense and HP. Defense once. Oh wow, it's actually gonna do it again. It's gonna hit defense twice, just for no reason. And last subset is gonna be last subset is gonna be defense. All right, all right. And now for our sands, we hit crit damage. Oh, <gasps> wait, this is actually insane. Okay, every time I get excited, everything bad happens, and I never get the things that I want. I shouldn't have got excited. I really shouldn't have gotten excited. But we did get crit damage three times, which is insane for our sands. Unfortunately, we do not have a pyro damage goblet, but hopefully we can find that later on. So we're just gonna put whatever purple artifact they have for their pyro damage back to the artifact domain we go all right uh yeah time for the artifact obeyed these people are gonna carry me these random people they have level 90 characters wait one of our team has just died right away okay just when i was saying that thankfully we're doing a lot of damage regardless so oh my god we got geo damage bonus i thought we were about to get pyro for a second i just got the most amount of five star artifacts in a domain ever since 2019 and the game hasn't even come out at that point goblet circlet goblet circlet goblet cryo flower not the thing that i need i don't know what's happening but we have two people outside the map like they went afk for a second i think this guy's trolling or something i have never seen someone do that before that is actually very interesting oh my god we just got four artifacts oh my dude what is going on super good sands but it has hp main stat unlucky but regardless this is just insane getting four gold artifacts is very rare i'm pretty sure and i never get that on my own account <laughs> all the wrong artifacts but you know what it's back up elemental mastery this is actually such a good piece holy i don't even know what character needs this elemental mastery characters like fish i guess i don't know okay oh my god is that a goblet that's a circlet why does that look so weird healing damage bonus yep lenny's definitely gonna heal my uh, my characters for sure okay so this is my lady at the moment level 80 level 80 weapon artifacts four piece but of course we don't have our circlet or goblet and then our talents are 665 which i think is fine we will go back to lenny but for now i think it's time to build lynette now, since I know most of you wouldn't want to watch my 10 agonizing hours of building Shangling, Bennett, and Lynette, and yes, I almost lost my sanity doing all of this at some point, I could basically sum up what I did to level up those characters and how or what I built for them. To start, Shangling. I was pretty excited to build her because personally, I didn't build her on my own account or my main account, so I had to do some extensive research on how to build her. Also, thank you Zyox, he truly was the guy. <laughs> 
Pyro Regisfines, yeah. I had to fight that about 10 different times because we basically had zero Everflame seeds in our inventory. It's okay though, Aldum, if you're watching this because thankfully I had a friend of mine help me through this and um, well, most of my characters are all Pyro and yeah, you know where that could have headed towards. Aside from Ascension and talent level up materials needed for Shangling, I had to farm the Emblem Artifact Domain because Shangling needed the four piece elemental burst bonus to support my Lenny team. Did we get any crazy artifacts well um you'll have to see later on next the one and only benito honestly one of my favorite four star characters in genshin impact and can i just say why are there so many good four star characters like fischl sincho sucrose like if you guys haven't had these characters on your roster yet and they're just laying on your account i would highly recommend building them and just thank me later okay however for bennett i needed the pyro registered as well so i had to go back and farm those materials and i could say it was definitely a better experience than before because i had another friend of mine help me out and all i will say is child too op even though he had a banner for almost like every version <laughs> Now for the weapon. I had a sack sword laying around, so I leveled that up to an efficient amount, and then I had to go farm the teaching of residence domain for those talent level materials. Now, I will say that it's crazy that so many new or even existing players never level up their talents for their characters. And I know one of you guys watching this definitely has not leveled up your talents yet, so I would highly recommend doing so because, you know, if you don't, then you're gonna miss out on that big PP damage that you can do with your characters. I won't even live though, I think I discovered it probably around ar40 because um brain farm moment lastly i built one of the new fontaine characters lynette also not really new since we now have nouvellet out now so uh yeah uh new from the last update lynette thankfully was an easier character to build because i had previously built her on my own main account and kind of got the grasp on how to build her and what she needed to be a better character four piece vv set and make sure her skill and ultimate talents were leveled up also needed the favonia sword also sax really good and yeah building lynette was a smooth sailing experience and we were pretty much done building all of our characters aside from all the artifacts that i had to farm next that i didn't even want to think about so this is what happened next so to review our roster that we have currently once again Linny, one to two ratio at the moment the great magic that could probably level up to level 90 when she actually wants to do that talent 665 now we have shangling level 70 ignore the stats we don't have the artifacts right now favonius lance level 80 and then her talents are 366 Six. Lynette, uh, you basically saw Lynette and you don't want to look at her artifacts. Uh, yeah, let's not talk about the artifacts that he, she has currently. <laughs> and then we have Bennett that I actually am kind of proud of. I don't know why, um, even though he doesn't have artifacts as well. Uh, we actually built him a good amount. 388, thankfully, because she has a C5 constellation. And so, yeah, we have our party. Now it is time to go to the artifact domain. Dun, dun, dun. So, yeah, we're going to be using all the fragile resin that we have to build these characters and get them the right artifacts that they need and hopefully get some really good subsets and main stats on them which uh honestly doesn't really happen but you know maybe we might just get that godly artifact that we haven't gotten in our gungeon impact experience will it happen i don't think so but you know we can only pray so with that being said let's go to the artifact domain oh god thankfully Linny does have their artifacts so i don't need to farm the artifacts right now so we will go to shangling shangling artifacts shangling does need a four piece emblem set and that is what we're going to be aiming for so now that we kind of have our characters leveled up and Linny only has their artifacts i kind of want to showcase the damage that we do with all the characters i think we haven't shown it too much but yeah this is actually a pretty good domain for it because you know we have electro and pyro is really good against electro i don't know if there's any debuffs in this domain because i didn't check but i want to first remove this guy's shield so we can actually showcase the big damage after let's see how much damage oh oh god we're we're, at, we're dying okay i think we did 22k that's actually really really good because Lenny is just insane oh i didn't even use my fragile resin uh wow that's kind of embarrassing i'm just gonna quickly use 20 in my fragile resin and yeah that's more like it uh 1500 resin that's gonna be wasted all to artifacts so god okay yep we have to do this domain one more time but now that we have all the resin that we need let's hopefully find the emblem sets that we need and we've got a circlet first of all attack oh my god i was actually waiting for like a crit damage an insane first set okay second run let's hopefully get another emblem set attack that's actually a good first mate set that we need we're looking for attack or elemental mastery for their sands so honestly i'll take that attack dude emblem set again oh 
HP flower, crit rate. Oh, wait, we're actually almost getting like the right set. This doesn't have the right subsets, but Jesus Christ, we're just getting emblem over emblem. This is actually amazing right now. Okay, we have one more condensed resin after this. Surely we won't get a other set. Circlet, crit rate, elemental mastery. Okay, we're actually getting the shangling artifacts like right away. I think we have a four piece set at this point. We have the sands, we have the flower, we have the feather, and now we have the circlet. And there we go. Linny's just a big carry. And let's see if we get another emblem set. You know, we already get our four piece artifact set, but you never know. Electro damage bonus. That's actually good for... Why did I think that we had an electro character for a second? <laughs> All right, let's just level up the artifacts that we just got for Shangling. First of all, it was this flower that we have currently in attack. So far, three good subsets that we need. Sorry, three, I mean two. Uh, my, my math. <gasps> energy recharge. Wait, this is actually really good. Energy recharge. It just hit energy recharge. Um, This is insane. This is actually insane. This is a good run for just Shangling's artifacts. Just give us one more energy recharge. One more. And, oh, uh, defense. It actually hit defense. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We have one emblem. Now let's go to our feather. Not the greatest feather once again, but maybe the fourth stack can change our mind okay leveled up the feather let's attach that really quickly and then go to our sands that we just recently got to wait i thought we just got a sands earlier attack that's actually a good first mate set that we need i might actually have mistaken that for the goblet that is actually so unlucky but we do have our circlet that we can use so let me level this one up give me crit damage crit damage last stops that oh you know i'll take the element to master defense and hp oh god wait this these subsets are actually really really bad i hope we can get a better circlet oh god wait we actually hit the worst subsets i, I don't i didn't realize how bad this circlet was but it's okay and then we have an off piece for our goblet doesn't have crit rate doesn't have crit damage or energy recharge but once again just looking for a decent decent artifact so i kind of ran out of crystal cores while condensing more resin and here's me losing more of my sanity collecting these little freaking okay let's just start bro come on i'm gonna lose it i'm gonna lose it i'm gonna lose it i'm gonna lose it all right i just crafted five more condensed resin and all i'm looking for is one more emblem artifact because it's all we really need and i'm actually a big fan of this domain because you know pyro characters are just really good in this domain and it doesn't really take a long time to actually kill these characters <gasps> this is a goblet cryo it's always cryo i swear to god i don't know why i always get cryo damage bonus whenever i get a goblet i don't know if cryo is just that main set you that you just get but jesus christ i I swear to god even on my main account i will get cryo damage bonus i know some of you guys can relate unless you get a different damage bonus i don't know maybe it could be pyro or something but it's always cryo for me it's always cryo and i'm actually starting to hate it now <laughs> okay oh this is sans i'm pretty sure right sans defense hp i just accidentally used my ultimate i don't know what happened i just literally just pressed the button by accident I think we hit 50k right there. I don't know how much damage that was, but that was a crazy amount. All right, we're 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 almost done with our condensers and I don't know what happened to all of it. Crit rate, energy recharge. I don't know if this one, this one's definitely better because we got really bad subsets from the other one. So maybe I can rock this one instead and get energy recharge subset. Okay, is this our last condenser resin? It is. Wow, it actually went by super, super fast. I was just getting not the right artifacts. This is actually a really good flower. Maybe we can trade that in for the one we have now. And a really good flower for the Shiminawa, however you pronounce it. Honestly, I think I think we're gonna move on from shangling since we have a three piece set already and we'll go back to shangling and we'll just move on to bennett you know i wish there was a way to get condensed resin quicker because every single time i just gotta go back to the crafting bench it's kind of like an l i don't know why if when you don't get the right artifact that you need you just go to the crafting bench and you're like oh god gotta craft five more just to go back into the artifact domain woo but for bennett we do need a four piece noblesse and noblies i don't remember the enemies that are in this artifact domain and oh wait we have cryo mages and a hydro mage which actually actually is really good but then i see that pyro mage which uh okay let's see what artifacts we get from this domain you know we didn't get the best artifacts from the art of domain off to a great start didn't even get the right artifact set that we need okay so this domain is actually fairly easy i mean compared to the one that we played earlier the problem is if we can get the right artifact sets and goblet hp actually we do need that for bennett so we got two artifacts and we got hp pyro damage bonus is what we're looking for and attack one noblesse artifact on the board for bennett Oh my god, I just realized the way this Pyro Abyss Mage shield goes down is because there's a Hydro Abyss Mage that literally just... It, it's friendly fire. This guy is literally drawing for content. This guy is destroying the Pyro Abyss Mage's shield, and that's the way I get it down. Elemental Mastery Goblet. You ever get trapped in a corner and this guy just has this ice particles down? That always happens to me, and it just did right now. 
Oh my god, cryo damage bonus. It's always cryo damage bonus. It has such good subsets too. That's so unfortunate. So unfortunate. Cryo damage bonus. Yep, that's exactly what we need. Holyverse, that's... We definitely have a cryo character on our team right now. Obviously. Maybe it's Lynette. I don't know. Does Lynette have a secret element that we just don't know of? Who knows? Alright, Lost Condensed Resin. Unfortunately, we did not get the four-piece set that we need. And Geo damage bonus. Okay, at least, at least it's not cryo. Wait, I just realized we have a Noblesse Feather right now. Wait, let me actually level this one up. Wow, that is actually one of the worst subsets I've seen in a while. Maybe we shouldn't level it up. Maybe we'll get a feather in this run. I don't know. And we do have a flower. I don't know if Autumn just got these from when they started playing Genshin Impact. I think they give you no bless. This one seems pretty good. It has elemental mastery, energy recharge. I'm sure the last subset will be pretty good because we've been getting really bad subsets and main sets on our artifacts. So yeah, this one will be definitely good. Attack. I'll take that. I'll actually take that. That's actually amazing. Energy recharge. Oh, it hit it two times. Wait, wait, pause champ. I'll take it. Attack. Energy recharge twice and then attack. I will be more than glad to take that. You know, a feather is a, a different story, but the last subset's gonna be HP. I will take that as well because, I mean, it's a good subset for Bennett. Bennett's a healer at the end of the day, and I'll take that crit rate too. You know, I'll take that crit rate. Oh, wait, I just ran out of artifacts. That's not good. <laughs> wait, we actually ran out of artifacts. That's actually really bad. Um, I guess we'll just farm the artifact domain a little bit more so we can get more artifacts. Mm -hmm. Feather is actually super, super good. Let's just uh, go to this one and kind of completely disregard the one we leveled up earlier. Level 16 is fine, I think. And we hit attack. Crit rate, attack, elemental mastery. Doesn't have energy recharge, but maybe we'll get it in the future. It's okay, though, because I think we have a four piece set for Bennett now, I'm pretty sure, right? Yep, four piece to bless. And we'll just put a random artifact for now. I think since we have a four piece for Bennett, I think we'll be fine with that. And then we'll just wait. Why did I continue doing this domain? Oh, maybe just for a better piece. And then we'll just go to our Lenny or Lynette. Sorry. I don't know why, but I just call Lynette sometimes Lenny. Four piece VV set for Lynette. I was gonna say Linny. I was gonna say Linny. I don't know what happened there. Tongue twister. Literally just, it's crazy how you just need one venti on your team and then you can just kill all these enemies super, super quickly because you just piled them all up. Wow, that actually took super long. That took like two minutes just to do the domain, but maybe that will come with a reward of just the right artifacts that we need. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, we got a feather. Oh, that's actually a pretty good feather for Lynette. Three more times, three more times. Yes, off piece. Ooh, okay. And no. so after farming the domain five different times and we actually co-opted it because it was way better and way faster compared to using my characters that I have right now. I wish I had Venti. I wish I had Venti. I had to now level up my artifacts. See which one has a better subset and that one does not have a better subset. Let's see if the other one has a better subset than the one I just got. Crit rate. Okay, we'll take that crit rate. I'll take that energy recharge too. Two good subsets already. And then our last subset. You know what? I'm actually running out of artifacts. You know, that's not good. Let's see if we can actually level this one to level 20. Hopefully, if I have enough artifacts. And hey, Kurt Ray, Kurt Ray and Energy Recharge is actually really good subsets. And we did not get a Goblet yet. And honestly, I don't know if they have a Nemo damage bonus. Do they? Oh, they don't. No Nemo damage bonus goblet. Our circlet, and we have no circlet. So we do need to go back to this domain because we do not have our goblet, circlet, or our sands. And we're almost done with all the resin that we just used earlier. So that's actually kind of crazy. Oh my god. I have been getting the best veridescent artifact so far. This is actually a really crazy piece. What the heck? <gasps> we reached level 50. So after using a lot more fragile resin, or sorry, condensed resin, it was time for one of the best artifacts I've seen in a long time. Holy crap what is this what is this piece this is um so i kind of ran out of resin and i think you guys know where i'm going at after i think the rest of my resin is actually going to go towards lenny now so i just refreshed my resin to add the last of my resin this is actually the last amount of resin i'm going to use for lenny so i have my flower for lynette i don't really have my feather i actually just got a really good piece for my feather so i'll use this one okay this has this actually has all the best subsets you can get in the game so this is actually a really good piece already first energy recharge i'm running out of artifacts already oh god wait uh yeah we're running out of artifacts so let me actually keep that and then we'll put our sands elemental mastery sands and energy recharge is actually so big oh my god it hit energy recharge one time maybe twice okay not twice i was anticipating it too much but uh i think i'll level this one up to level 12 because once again we we ran out of artifacts i thought we were gonna have way more but i guess we don't i didn't even max out all my artifacts for Linny, so yeah let's go to Linny and hopefully get some good artifacts i just realized our feather does not have crit damage our flower doesn't have crit damage okay yeah we're definitely farming artifacts for Linny. let's go okay back to the domain for Linny. this one 
one's going to be pretty interesting because I did not do this domain with my current roster that I have now with it being updated. So I'm kind of curious how much damage we'll do. We're doing way more damage than when we first came here. It's actually so cool. It's so satisfying seeing the difference between when we first do these domains. I'm actually so happy about this, dude. I think the transformation of this account has gone from being one of the worst or cursed accounts I've seen in such a long time to probably being a very viable one. I mean, it's always fun seeing people's reactions. And I mean, this did take a long time, but I think it's worth it in the end. Because hearing or seeing a smile on someone's face is always the best thing in the world. Crit damage flower. Did we get a crit damage flower already? I'm pretty sure we did already. Dude, look at the damage we are doing. Holy, I just saw 47k. Yeah, this is insane. This is actually insane. 47k is actually crazy though. Now Autumn is going to make me want to steal their account and uh, run away with it. <laughs> Imagine if I did that. That would be so funny. That wouldn't be funny. That would, I would actually be uh, doing a crime right there. So uh, yeah, that wasn't funny at all. But let's uh, quickly get our artifacts that we need and let's see if we get any good ones. Oh, Sans. Sans is the right one. Attack, Curry. Okay. 54k is our new record. I just did all of our ultimates, like kind of timing them right and kind of using it in the proper order. I'm pretty sure it goes by Bennett, Lynette, Shangling, and Ned Linny. Hopefully we get a new record after this. I'm going to be keeping track of our damage and if we do a crazy amount, our last other condensed resin and honestly i've been just more happy just seeing the progress on our account rather than just the artifacts that we've been getting so we did get this feather which could be good and i'm just looking for crit damage crit damage is what we need of course because our feather doesn't have crit damage it only has crit rate so please don't give me crit damage oh wow it actually did that maybe i'll work on this one maybe please give me crit damage 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 and <gasps> reverse psychology confirmed doesn't work <gasps> Wait, this is actually perfect. Why does the best artifacts come in last? Like, why couldn't they give me this earlier in the game? So level 20 flower. Once again, we still got to find a flower, actually. I just realized that. Little by little, all our resin are going down. But once again, it's for a good reason. It's for Linny. We hit a 61k. That's our new record. Once again, we're just keeping track of all the new records. 61k is insane. What the? I bet if we just hit randomly at 100k. I think that would top it all off. But I don't know if this roster can. 63k. Why don't we just keep hitting like way more damage than we are before next one will hit 70k trust uh, 70k will be the next one 65k <gasps> and i only hit it at one enemy i was planning to do it on a different enemy which was the girl that literally moves around all the time 65k we're hitting a new record 70k is gonna be the next one trust i keep saying trust but like actually trust me like 70k will be the one lenny why are you just so insane i don't get it lenny's just the best character in genshin impact i guess okay so after hitting some crazy new records of the damage that we're doing with the roster uh we're done with that one what adventure rewards do you get when you hit air 50 oh you get two fragile resin um you know what we'll just keep that we won't actually use that because you know we don't want to waste their new fragile resin that they get more condensed resin <laughs> oh wait i think i just ran out of crystal cores oh god let me go farm some real quickly and so after farming my crystal cores i had to go back to the painful artifact domain but i had some help this time with some random co-op players thank you so much however my artifacts were not the greatest to say the least Pyro damage bonus? Whoa. Wait, I actually didn't think we would get this. This is actually pretty crazy. If it hits crit damage, I will literally be the happiest man alive. I'm not going to lie. And hit defense. Okay. At least it has pyro damage bonus. Copium. I'm just hoping we can get something good before we run out of all our fragile resin that we use. I'm really happy with the outcome regardless, once again. Like, we've been getting insane artifacts, but to end it off in a bang would be even better. And with our last condensed resin, that was actually a pretty long run, to be honest. Uh, yeah, nothing. Okay, now it's finally time to use our last condensed resin our last five that we have yeah this will actually be the last of our Linny. Linny, uh i didn't get the best artifacts unfortunately from these last runs but i'm really hoping for something crazy with the last five condensed resin that we have left over this has been such a journey like this has been probably like 12 plus hours of just building farming collecting every single thing just to make this account a better version than before i'm gonna make a comparison from when i first started playing to right now i mean I can just compare it right now. I think this is a good comparison side by side uh, where you guys could see like the progress we have gotten. I mean, you guys can't really get the full story of when I was farming for Lynette, for Bennett, and for Shangling, but it was a very long adventure. I had a lot of help. Thank you, Stell, Abby, Lumine, and this person named Dookie, I'm pretty sure. This guy literally just helped me out for like hours and hours just because he felt like, I don't know, this guy was really, really nice. But yeah, we're just going to complete this domain and we'll see if we get any good artifacts left over for Lenny and I'll get back to you guys after one condensed resin that's actually not bad feather great whenever I say not bad by the way it means copium but we're not going to talk about that <laughs>
<laughs> Second condensed resin. HP. HP. Third condensed resin. Fourth condensed resin. Wow, defense. Oh, that's exactly what we didn't need. All right, let's unleash. This is literally my last run. I will literally unleash everything. I was saving my ultimate for the next run. Yeah, this is it. This is actually my last run. Yeah, we really didn't get anything for Linny except this actually decent uh, flower, which I think that's exactly what we needed. I, for some reason, I didn't get any flowers for Linny. The head crit damage or crit rate. So yeah, of course, it gives us in the last uh, run. <laughs> Crit rate and crit damage. Wow, it actually gave me the last run. That's actually kind of crazy. Now, I think it's just crit damage. Okay, yep. Now it's just a moment of truth to see what subsets we get from whatever it gives us. I've gone through pain and suffering just to get this, which is kind of crazy. But crit rate, crit rate. Oh my. Wait, this is actually kind of crazy. Guys, every time I get excited, something bad always happens. And it probably will. It probably hit any HP or defense. We'll just keep calm on this one. We just have our last subset or we have one more subset to level up and it will be. Yeah, once again, it's always it's always when I get excited, but crit damage and crit rate, I will be more than glad to take that because we had only crit rate on our last artifact. So yeah, this is the roster once again that we were left with. I want to showcase the final results of our stats. Lenny does have a one to two ratio, a little bit more for crit damage, which is amazing. Artifacts, you guys got a good grasp, but just going to showcase the stats. I wanted to build energy recharge and elemental mastery for Shangling because she is support. Bennett energy recharge is always important. Energy recharge is up 200 plus percent. And then Lenny energy recharge and elemental mastery elemental mastery could be a little bit better but i forgot we don't even have our sword built up but i'll tell them i'll tell autumn to build up all these things once they actually use their resin and once they actually refills rather than using their fragile resin but once again this has been a very long adventure i would really appreciate it if you guys could like the video because this took a very very long time it's gonna take a very long time editing it but we're not going to talk about that i'll be happy when you guys watch this and yeah we'll be able to fix another viewer's account in the future and maybe it could even be yours so yeah that's pretty much it guys so see ya